So I'm having this massive panic attack, a release of crying. I'm crying and crying and feeling this pain of, you know, like my soul literally wanting to leave my body because I, I do, I do um, because of my childhood traumas, I do disassociate with my body very frequently. And to be in my body, to be very present is actually something that I've worked through my art. And that has helped me to come into the being that I am and connect my body, mind and soul all together. But as I'm going through this experience, because the moment my body is in pain and my, my physical body feels any kind of pain, I boom get out of it and so I don't feel the pain as much and so I have learned through art to bring myself back into the body be very present and stay there to understand the feelings and emotions that are coming upwards and you know what is it that I'm feeling so I can be an observer and look through and feel through so I'm going through this thing and I ask Alamia I have always seen the good in people. I have always seen the good in any situation, in any experience that you have given me. How, how have I not been seen as beautiful or um, as worthy for love or for anything? Why have I been treated the way I've been treated by many around me? And he said, for you to be able to see beauty in others, you must have it in yourself first. He said, to see beauty in any situation, you have to have that in you for you to choose to see that in any situation. And I realized that beauty is God. God is beauty. So when you recognize that you are beautiful because he created you beautiful. The reason you can see hope, light in any situation is not because you are doing anything. He chose to create the beauty, the light in you for you to be able to see any, any kind, tiny, little, tiny, in the darkness, in the darkest of lights, nights, you can actually see the light in the stars he put in you to see beauty because he put in you beauty because he made you beautiful isn't that amazing isn't that amazing that when he created us he created us as beautiful it is we who judge ourselves as not or beautiful so with that thought I hope that this brings you some kind of grounding and understanding of how truly beautiful you are in the eyes of your creator. With lots of love, light and peace everyone. Enjoy your day and take care of yourselves.